Maryland is a state in the eastern United States. Virginia to the south and West Virginia to the west of Washington, D.C., Pennsylvania to the north, and Delaware to the east. The U.S. Naval Academy is located in Annapolis, Maryland, and the NSA is also located in the state. It covers an area of 32,133 square kilometers and has a population of 6,052,177, 2017 estimate. It is the number one state in the U.S. with per capita income thanks to rich people near Washington, D.C. It is said to be named after Queen Henrietta Maria, wife of Charles I. It was founded by George Calvert, Baron of Baltimore, during the reign of Charles I, who was beheaded by Oliver Cromwell. That's why Baltimore, the largest city in Maryland, was named after a manor owned by his family. Even the state flag is Baltimore's coat of arms, and Calvert's name is everywhere. It is also famous for spending the largest budget per area in the United States. The most widely known nickname is Old Line State. Other nicknames include Free State, Little America, and America in Miniature. The motto of the state is, Fatty Mashi, Parole Femin, in Latin or Medieval Italian. The most famous cities are Annapolis and Baltimore, the state capital, and the MLB club Baltimore Orioles and the NFL club Baltimore Ravens. Universities include the University of Maryland near Washington, D.C., Johns Hopkins University in Baltimore, and the U.S. Naval Academy in Annapolis. It is a state with a strong democratic tendency. Except for three times since 1960, he has supported the Democratic Party in the presidential election. Senate all but one member of the House of Representatives out of 10 are Democrats. There are 10 presidential electors. During the COVID-19 epidemic in the U.S. in 2020, it had a relationship with Korea. At that time, the Maryland government tried to import diagnostic kits from Korea, which was selected as a model country for quarantine. In the process, then-Governor Hogan asked his wife to arrange with a Korean company, which was known to the media. Since then, several Korean companies have expressed their intention to supply diagnostic kits, and contracts have been concluded. However, President Donald Trump, who was in a bad relationship at the time, devalued him, saying, there was no need for that. However, the approval rating of Governor Hogan soared to 80% at the time as Maryland residents supported the governor's move more. Governor Hogan reportedly thanked South Korea. The governor of Maryland has the most authority to exercise among U.S. governors. It usually requires the consent of two-thirds of Congress to overturn the veto of the head of the administration, president, governor, etc. Unusually, the Maryland governor's veto can be overturned with more than 60% of state and House of Representatives approval. There are only a few states in the United States that define the quorum for rejection of the veto as 60%. It is also notorious for its bizarre constituency. Thanks to this, Republican votes in the region are more than 30%, but the number of members of the House of Representatives falls further to 1 to 7. The state legislature is overwhelmingly occupied by Democrats, and the Republican governor cannot even block it with a veto. The headquarters of Pyraxis Games, the production company of Sid Meier's Civilization, is here. It is also the site of Epic Games' first startup. He was in Maryland until 1999, but moved to North Carolina, where he is now. Lockheed Martin's headquarters are in Bethesda, Maryland. Bethesda Softworks and its subsidiary Bethesda Game Studio, known for its Fallout series and Elder Scrolls series, are located in Rockville, Maryland. It originally started in Bethesda, the same place as the company's name, but moved to what is now Rockville in 1990. The sporting goods company Under Armour headquarters is in Baltimore. Since it is close to Washington, D.C., where the federal government is located, there are many government agencies and research institutes based in Maryland. National Institutes of Health, NIH, FDA, Food and Drug Administration, NIST, National Institute of Standards, and Intelligence Agencies NSA and the Nuclear Energy Commission, NRC. Baltimore is set in HBO's famous drama The Wire. In the drama, it is portrayed as a troubled city where nothing works properly, whether it is politics, education, or police. The Silence of the Lambs is also set in Baltimore.